Chapel. Adam Brooks again causing problems for this Bronco power play. And this time he'll chip it up the left wing and down. Just seven seconds left in the man advantage as Hitlerington quickly leads Rigby on left wing and he'll shoot from the half wall. That's stopped easily by the stick of Wapple. And now Colby Williams will bank it up the boards on right wing for Connor Gay. And now we've got a fight. Cal Burles and Carter Rigby. They get this game underway as the Pats penalty kill is over. Burles throws a stick out of the way. Throws a left jab as he tries to tie up. Rigby has the jersey on Pat on Cal Burles' left arm. Then throws a big right over top. And Burles goes down to his knees. And that'll do it for this fight. 4-0-1 in the first period. Scoreless game. The Pats just killing off their first man disadvantage for Southland Mall. Yeah, not sure what uh, sparked that one, but uh, you don't see that too often. Burroughs kind of calling time out before things get going, leans down, slides the stick out of the way. I don't think he quite got set again before they were in there. Rigby shakes himself free of the initial tie-up and then ends the fight with one quick shot. Looks like Burroughs was okay, didn't uh, stagger him or anything like that. Just a good stiff shot right to the jaw, and that toppled Burroughs. Now Rigby... Had Burles' jersey on the arm kind of over top yeah. his hand and held, so Burles wasn't able to, to grab onto everything. Then he just let go of that arm as he grabbed it and then awesome. got a swift right to the side of Burles' head, which spun him around.